if you're on your phone and you go to vocaroo.com, click the microphone button. You'll see a pop-up that asks you, would you like to access the microphone? And you're going to select allow. Now you're going to start recording and you'll see the seconds are changing on the right hand side of the blinking button. When you're done recording, just hit that red blinking square. And at this point, you can click the play button and listen to it and make sure you like it. If you like it, you'll click save and share. And once you click this, you'll have some different options. You can copy the URL link and share that anywhere you'd like in an email, maybe in a document for feedback. There's also a button for an email and that if you would like to use makes it really easy just to email it from your phone. It will open up your email. You can select which email account you want to send it from. You could change the subject add your recipients. I'm going to add a test student that I have and I'm going to test it out and make sure it all works okay on their end. And then once you have everything added here, you click send. If you're going to be using Vocaroo a lot, it would be helpful if you add it to your home screen even. So to do that, once you're at the Vokuru site on your phone, you're going to click that little share icon on the bottom center. It's a little square with an arrow pointing up. Click that. You'll select Add to Home Screen. You can rename it if you want. If you click Add, you'll see that there it is, an icon on your home screen. You can move it around anywhere you'd like, but if you open it up, it goes right to the Vokuru site. Thank you.